morning and welcome to the session. I am Shashi and I am going to help you with the following question. Question says, find all points of discontinuity of function f where fx is equal to sin x upon x if x is less than 0, fx is equal to x plus 1 if x is greater than equal to 0. First of all, let us understand that function f is discontinuous at x equal to a if Left hand side limit of the function is not equal to right hand side limit of the function at x equal to a. When left hand side limit of a function do not coincide right hand side limit of the function at x equal to a, then function is discontinuous at x equal to a. This is the key idea to solve the given question. Now let us start the solution. We are given function f given by fx equal to sin x upon x if x is less than 0 and fx is equal to x plus 1 if x is greater than or equal to 0. Now clearly we can see given function is defined at every real number. Now let us discuss continuity of the function at every point less than 0. We are given fx is equal to sin x upon x if x is less than 0. Now, sine function is continuous at every real number and this is a polynomial function. It is also continuous at every real number. Now, we also know that quotient obtained by dividing two continuous functions is also continuous. So, we can write function f is continuous at every real number less than 0. Now let us discuss continuity of the function at all the points greater than 0. We are given function f given by fx equal to x plus 1 if x is greater than 0. Now, this is a polynomial function and we know polynomial function is continuous at every real number. So, given function f is continuous at every real number greater than 0. discuss continuity of the function at x equal to 0. At x equal to 0, limit of x tending to 0 minus fx. First of all, we will find out left hand side limit of the function. This is equal to limit of x tending to 0 minus sin x upon x. This is equal to 1. We know limit of theta tending to 0, sin theta upon theta is equal to 1. Here we have used this limit. Now we get left hand side limit of the function at x equal to 0 as 1. Now let us find out right hand side limit of the function at x equal to 0. This is equal to limit of x tending to 0 plus x plus 1. Now, this is equal to 
zero plus one, which is equal to one only. So we get right hand side limit as one. Now clearly we can see left hand side limit of the function is equal to right hand side limit of the function at x equal to zero. Let us now find out value of the function at x equal to zero. F zero is equal to zero plus one, which is equal to one only. Now we get limit of x tending to zero minus f x is equal to limit of x tending to zero plus f x is equal to f zero is equal to one. This implies given function f is continuous at x equal to zero. Since left hand side limit is equal to right hand side limit is equal to value of the function at x equal to zero, so given function f is continuous at x equal to zero. Now we know function f is continuous at all x greater than zero, all x less than zero, and x equal to zero. This implies function f is continuous at every real number, so there is no point of discontinuity. Thank you.